Hi. I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> Amy Mesh. Here. <laughs> I know. It's been like a week and a half since I made a video. Look, I got a lot going on and we got a lot to talk about. Um, and then we're going to do a Sheen haul. Not Timu, but Sheen. So, first of all, let me get my regular glasses on so you can see my face. These are my new, um, these are my new prescription sunglasses. So, you guys know these cutie patootie glasses that I wear every day that I ordered off of Zenny online. I love them so much, and I've sent some of you guys the order number and the link and all that good stuff. Um, absolutely love them. Very, very happy. The script was right on. And so because of that, I got myself a pair of prescription sunglasses and the black cat eye, which I absolutely love. And then when you order yours, and they're prescription, so my bifocals are in here. So when you order, you get to pick your reflective, you reflect the, the reflective shade that you want. And there's all different colors. You can do black, brown, mirrored. So I knew I wanted mirrored, but never have I seen the blue mirrored. Are those not stunning? My favorite color is blue. And I saw the perfect black frame and the blue mirrored shade. And I was like, those are mine. Get in my basket, take my money. And again, they sent them to me. They fit my face perfectly. You can do virtual try on. They fit my face perfectly. I'm super happy I can see sharp as a needle. It's a beautiful thing. So that's first thing. Second thing, one of the reasons I haven't made a video is because you guys know all of my phone drama. Well, we're on a new phone, okay? We're on a new phone. My phone went kaput. They sent me another phone, which was refurbished, which was in worse shape than the one before. It was like doing this lightning seizure thing across the screen. And I was like, I can't, I can't. We're not doing that. So long story short, I could go into great detail, but I'm not. Um, I went up to the Verizon store. They took care of me. I'm off of the Samsung and I am back on the Motorola. Um, I love my Motorola. I've had three Motorola phones before. My Samsung, I've always been very happy. Um, the only difference is um, the cameras on here cannot hold a candle to the Samsung Ultra, 23 Ultra that I had. So the camera quality is probably not going to be as good. It's not probably, it isn't as good as the Samsung. But overall, the phone, overall, I love this phone a whole lot better. Mm. I went by, um, what's that place called? Jamba Juice. And I got a small Strawberries Wild. And then I got a Handwich, which is a low calorie protein -y kind of thing. There's that. Before we get into the haul, I've got two requests from you guys. If you guys would do me a huge favor. First of all, my son Wyatt, you guys know Wyatt. He has started his own cleaning business, and the child will type A out and clean um, because, well, his dad and I raised him and his brother um, how to clean, and um, Wyatt has a type A personality, and he's really good. He's really good. So he opened up his own business. He got his LLC. He got his... Um, liability insurance. He's got his workers comp. He's got his business cards. He's got his yard signs. He's on the neighbors app, the Yelp app, the Facebook app, um, social media, word of mouth. He's got three solid customers right now, and he is a vendor for an apartment management community. So, um, all of this inside of two weeks. So he is, is slowly happening. Um, and I am helping him uh, admin his Facebook page. So, I'm going to link his Facebook cleaning page below. It's called York Cleaning LLC. It's that simple. His last name is York, York Cleaning LLC. Right now, he's a one-man show. If he gets busy, um, he's got friends that he can hire on that will come in and help him that will do just as good of a quality job. So, um, if 
I put his link below on Facebook. Any of you that are on Facebook, I would greatly appreciate it if you would go over to, click the link, go over to his Facebook page. I don't know if it'll be a link. I'll try to make it a link, but just go over to his Facebook page, York Cleaning LLC, and follow it or like it. Um, just, just go like, subscribe to his, just boost, boosting, you know, boost the child. He, he, he's almost 24. This is his first business he's ever opened. Um, I am officially free of doing any deep cleaning at my house anymore. Um, I hired him immediately because I knew he'd do a good job because he's my kid. And, um, but when he is over at my house cleaning, I give him the list of exactly what I want and how I want it done. And I don't treat him like my son. I treat him like I'm like I'm hiring him, which I am hiring him to come in. I pay full price. I'm mom and I pay full price um, because, you know, I'm trying to help him out. But, um, you know, I tell him what I want. And then after he cleaned my house the first time, like a professional, he came back in. He said, how was it? Is there anything else you would like done? What is there anything that I can do better for you? You know, what can we do better for you? And so he's very professional about it. Um, so if you could just go over there and, and boost his page, support him in liking and following, that would be amazing. Also, if you're in the Tulsa area, Glenpool, Jinx, Owasso, Broken Arrow, Inola, wherever. If you're in the surrounding areas and you need a good house cleaner, whether that's a one-time deal to come in and do one good clean, or if you want to get on a regular schedule, he does a great job, great prices. So if you'll go there and support Wyatt at York Cleaning LLC, it'll be in the description box below. We would appreciate that. Also, I have another request. <laughs> so I have a cousin. Her name is also Amy. And she has started her own YouTube channel. She's got a couple of shorts and she's got a couple of regular videos. Um, she is in marketing and she flies to California and all over the country doing marketing things and she loves to empower women and um, she has started her YouTube channel. I, she just started it. I think she has four subscribers. So she's got, you know, it's very tiny right now, but she's got big things she wants to do, you know, big, she's got big ideas and she wants to get that going. And so I am putting Amy out there I will link her channel to her Facebook below if you guys would go over there and subscribe. Um, her channel is called Miss Fancy Girl. Or Fancy, no, Fancy Girl Vlogs. It'll be in the description below if you'll go over there and click on Fancy Girl Vlogs. Subscribe to her. Give her some love and give her a boost. So, you guys, would you do that for me? Go, go support Wyatt and go support Amy. The information's down below. I would forever be grateful. I appreciate you. You guys have supported me so much over the years, and I know I can count on you to go support me and my family and their dreams and things they're trying to accomplish. So I would really appreciate that. Okay. Let's have a sheen haul. Um, but before we do, I want to show you this cutie patootie little um, side purse. What's it called? I'm losing my words. I need some air. Um you know, side saddle, whatever the heck it's called. Look what I found on Amazon. I'm sorry, what? It's made out of that scuba material. Adorable strap. It was like $14. I'll put the link for this down. Fourteen twenty. I don't remember how much it was. Cute, cute. It fits um, my little clear stuff with my gum and my medicine and my inhaler. My phone, my lotion, my keychain. Look what else I bought myself, you guys. So anyway, that's the purse. I'll put the link below. Guess what else I bought for myself? An e-reader. What? I am in love with this thing. I got a sub I got a subscription to um, Kindle. There's my books. There we go. I read a whole lot more with this. Y'all know I'm a huge reader, but I read a whole lot more with this because I can blow up the letters. It's incredible. So, real quick. You swipe, I'm probably the last one to get on board. You swipe up to unlock it or just put the power button and look how big I can make the words. I love it. And then we, and then to turn the page, you just kind of go like that. Turn the page. Love it. So easy to use. Freaking love it. 
I'm probably the last one in the whole world to get one of these, but it's one of the best little things I ever got for myself. Um, if I remember, I'll link that down below too. Okay, quickly, quickly, let's do our Sheen haul. Not Timu, it's Sheen. I hope this camera can keep up with what I'm trying to do. Okay, the first thing I got, and I've already opened this bag um, last night or the night before, night before last, because I couldn't wait, and I wasn't sure when I was going to get to vlog. But I got this little kimono, and it is the cutest thing. I'm probably going to wear it to work tomorrow, and it's just black lace with sunflowers. And what I love about it is a short sleeve kimono with little pom-poms on the sleeves. Excuse me. How cute is that? And it goes down just past my booty. It's just a, a kimono. And I absolutely love it. I'll try to do an OOTD with that. This is mostly going to be a jewelry haul because you know me. Okay, the next piece of clothing I got, and that's good quality. That's really good quality. So the next piece of clothing I got was this. It's a body con dress, body contour dress, which means it's fitted, it's stretchy. Okay, here's the top of it. It's black and white striped, but it's long. It's long. It goes all the way down almost to my ankles. But it is just a long, and this material is good and sturdy and thick. It's just a long dress, and I'll throw a denim shirt over it, or a kimono, or I think a hot pink kimono would look really cute over it. Put um, some black sandals on. You can mix that up with some cougar print earrings. I got some big cougar print pom-poms just to mix. I love mixing patterns. Mix floral or cougar with black and white stripes. Oh, I remember Cherie used to do that all the time. I miss her. And I, lot, I learned a lot of my mixing patterns and stuff from Cherie. Because Cherie always looked adorable. My girl, you need to get in my closet and show me how to dress. Okay, here we go. Let's get into some jewelry. The first thing I'm going to pull out is this cutie patootie little bracelet. It's just beaded and it's stretchy and it's got a heart. Super cute. Super cute. Is that? I'm not even going to put these back in the bag. Right here. Here's the next one. It's so fun. This would also look cute with that black and white striped dress. Look at this bracelet. <laughs> it looks like gumballs. Oh, where's the hook? Where's the hook? Okay, I'm going to have to fix it. I've got stuff at home. Oh, no, I don't. It's a different kind of hook. Oh, okay. It's a hook like this, and you just slide this little number in here. Okay, there it is. It's not broke. I just got to use my brain. Smarter than that bracelet. Isn't that cute? Love that. I prefer elastic, but it's it's okay. It's like a dollar fifty, so we're good. Okay, here's another bracelet. I feel like I have to hurry because I don't know how this phone's going to work. Um, here's another bracelet, and it is a magnet. Isn't that cute? Oh, yeah. That is adorable. Love that. I've got a watch on, but how cute is that? We're, we'll have that. Yes, please. Cute. I love the colors. Okay. Okay, this one I'm not a fan of. Um, if anything has a gold tone to it on Sheen, I don't recommend it. Um, the bracelet is cute, but the gold links are cheap, cheap. Like bubblegum machine cheap, right? So, here's this. It's got a little pops of turquoise. But this part is just super cheapy looking. It's got that kind of clasp. There's that. Here's another one. This one's gorgeous. Look at this. Isn't that stunning? I don't know if you can really see it in the light. It's just all different color rhinestones. Focus. Absolutely gorgeous. And that's a bracelet here. Isn't that pretty? We'll have that. Here's some earrings. Um, I was super happy with all of the earrings. Super happy. I got my hair cut Saturday. 
It's the shortest I've gone, and I absolutely love it. Love it. I'll never go back to long hair, probably. Okay, here's these. Aren't those cute? Oh, so freaking cute. Love those. The earrings I do want to put back in the package. Okay, these are cute. I got my door locked, don't worry. And I'm in a highly populated area, we're good. Look at these. They're little wooden for 4th of July. Stars, aren't those cute? We'll take those. We'll take those. Have that. Okay, here's another little bracelet. Kind of like the chain link one I showed you. But multicolored. But the gold is awful. The gold is awful. But the links are cute. Cute. But the gold is awful. But I'll wear it. I'll wear this one. I probably won't wear the other one, but I'll wear this one. I'll end up wearing that. Let's go ahead and put these in a bag together. This one just feels so light and just like bubblegum machine. This smoothie's good. Oh, y'all. Are you ready for this? Let me show, oh my gosh, when I opened these last night, I almost fell out. These would look cute with the black and white striped dress too. Real lightweight plastic floral pink dots. Oh my gosh. Yes. All the S's. How cute. How fun. And they're so lightweight, you can barely even fill them. I wish I had a longer neck. <laughs> Aren't those cute? Oh, in love with those. Okay, so there's those. I'm not going to get the other one out. Put my little favorite little gold hoop earring in that I got it. I think a few of you order these off Amazon. I just love them. Okay. What's that? Empty bag. Okay, love these too. These would look really good with what I have on today. How about those? That's cute. And that's wood. That's not leather. No, that is like a leather. It's not wood. It's like a leather. See? These are so cute. If you guys see dirt around my nails, it's because I laid, um, we laid 30 bags of mulch last night. Me and Shane. We laid 30 bags of mulch. So, I've got dirt around in my cuticles that I can't get out. Like, it's just going to have to work itself out. It's whatever. That's why I don't do my nails in the spring and summer. Okay, this bracelet's cute. I'm a little worried about the quality lasting very long, um, but it's a little silver bracelet with all the colored beads. I feel like any minute one of these are gonna pop out. If they do and I lose, you know, I, I still have the bead, I'll just super glue it back in. But it's real cute, it just slips on. Super cute, it looks real good with my Band-Aid, doesn't it? Super cute. There's that one. That one came bubble wrapped. We still recording? My little phone's hanging tight. Motorola is a pretty sturdy phone. You can throw it across the room and it'll never break. Check these out. Check these out. Oh, I'm super pumped about these two. These are wood and they're real lightweight. Holla! Are those not away girl earrings right there? Oh my gosh. I'm wearing those on Friday probably. Those will be a fun Friday earring. I like wearing big fun earrings on Fridays. Okay. I have to be all business today because we have a two o'clock meeting with a customer. Our owner is in town. So it's um, our company owner and Maggie. Y'all know Maggie, my director and me. And we have this contractual rate staffing meeting that we've got to go to. Okay, here's a bracelet. These are little bracelets. They're dainty and gorgeous. They're stretchy. Can you guys see? I don't know if we're focusing or not. I'm still learning this phone. This has a little heart dangle. God, how 
cute. Comes in a set of three. There's that one. Love this one. The heart and the turquoise. And this one. So dainty, so pretty, so in love with these. Love those. Let me put those back in the bag because we need those to be in the bag. Okay, here's a pair. I wore them yesterday, so I didn't have a bag for them. I'll pop them in the bag here. I wore them yesterday, and I tried to vlog yesterday, but it, it didn't happen. But I wore these yesterday, yes, I think yesterday, and they're so freaking cute. Look at those. What? Aren't those cute? Love them. Love them. We'll have those. I got a lot of compliments on those yesterday. We're almost done. Okay, these are super fun too. I went for fun, colorful, summery. Look at those. Aren't those precious? We're going to have those. Aren't they cute? Yes. And they're the uh, the acrylic. Clarissa. These are acrylic. Your favorite. Y'all know Rissa B. Vloggin. She's a jewelry fanatic also. And acrylic is her favorite. It, you know why? Probably. I don't know why it is a favorite for her. But why I love it is because you can wear big fun earrings and they're not heavy. They're just not heavy. And they're easy. And you can't hurt them. You can't break them. Oh, I love these also, but they're purple, and I never wear purple, so I don't know how I'm going to work these out, but I'll figure something out. They look like a navy blue online, which is why I bought them, but they're not. They're purple, but they're so cute. See those? I'll figure it out. Heck, I could wear it with these, with this shirt. You can mix color. That'd be cute. Love those. Because y'all know I need more earrings like I need a hole in my head. Let's see what else. Is that it? That is it. That is the end of my haul. Put all this back in there gently. Let me put all this back in there gently. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. I'm oh, oh, there is something else. Um... And I'll show you in another video, but um, y'all know the Jesus Trail I was doing. It was um, 39 mile Jesus Trail. I finished. They sent me my Jesus Trail medal. It's about that big. It's on a gorgeous lanyard or whatever it's called. Gorgeous. So I got that. And in the interim, um, I also, after I finished that challenge, I signed up for the Rome challenge and that was 34 miles and I finished that. And so my Rome medal is being shipped to me right now. So that's cool. Um, and if your watch is attached, you're going to get all your workouts in and your daily steps. So your daily steps count towards um, your medal if you have a smart watch, which is why I was able to get through them both real quick because this is my life. I'm walking everywhere all the time, all the time, all over my house, all over work. When I'm running La Fortune, I've been, you know, I went to La Fortune last night. I do laps around my neighborhood, um, working in the yard last night, mowing the lawn. All of that counts if you're going forward. Um, swimming, rowing, all that. So my other medal's coming to me. One more spit of news. You guys remember when I was um, going to the row house twice a week and me and Maggie were rowing? We start back up tomorrow, so we're going to be rowing once a week. And all of those miles, if I decide to sign up for another medal, all of those miles will also go toward a medal. So I don't know if I'm going to get another medal. I just wanted to do one or two because I'll get all these medals and then what I'm going to do with them. Put them in a drawer, you know, I don't know. But anyway, um, it's just fun. So I think that's it. I'm trying to catch you guys up on everything. Okay, I think that's it. My new little phone hung in there. Y'all have to tell me how the camera quality is. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think of my new Sasa haircut? So the reason I went so short, one, is because I wanted to try it. I wanted to try it. Here's the side. 
in the back. I wanted to try to go shorter because I just wanted to see it. Um, but also, Shanna, who does my hair, is going to be out of commission. She's getting surgery on her wrist. So she's going to be out of commission until the middle of July. So it's going to be a good two months before I can get in there. And anybody who has short hair knows that two months is a long time because it's you got to maintain it. So I was like, girl, let's take off a little bit more since I'm not going to be able to see you. And call me if you need me to come and help take care of you while you're getting your surgery, which she won't because she's got a huge family. Anywho, okay, that's what's going on in my life. I've missed you guys. I love you. The Lord loves you more. I hope everybody had a fabulous Mother's Day. I would prefer not to talk about mine. I was on the struggle bus. Hard. But I pushed through. I'm good. My sister is good. Um, I hope everybody had a fabulous Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all of you guys. Happy late Mother's Day. I love you. The Lord loves you more. He loves you so, so much. We'll see you in the next video.